Honorable Judge Kevin Ross presiding. Ladies and gentlemen, you may be seated. All parties have been sworn, Your Honor. Thank you, Deputy Thomas. This case involves Mr. Levi Berry. Mr. Berry, I understand you're suing Teresa Collins in the amount of $400 over a gaming console. Is that correct? Uh, yes, Your Honor. All right, so why are we here, sir? Your Honor, um, the defendant and I have a child together. How old? Um, seven years old. What's her name? Shauna. Shauna. Yes. Pretty name. Okay. Thanks. And I love my daughter, Your Honor, and I bought this gaming console for her as a gift. Now, my daughter lives with a defendant, and apparently what happened is, is that the defendant's son, who she had before I got there, has taken this over. This is Shauna's older half-brother. Exactly. And his name, ma'am? His name is Russell. Russell, okay. All right, so... You were in a relationship with Russell's dad prior to Mr. Barry. Is yes, that correct? Sir. And then you and Mr. Barry got together at some point, and then that's when Shauna came on. Right. All right. I got it. Continue. Okay. Now, apparently, Russell has taken over the gaming console. My daughter you mean would taken call over? Me. No. What do you my, mean taken over? My daughter would call me several times, Your Honor, crying, telling me that her brother has taking the game, putting it in his room, not letting her play with it. Um, there were several times where she's told me that he's locked the door no. to his bedroom, not letting her play with her own video game. All right. And, and this is the conversation you're having with Shauna? This is the conversation, yes, my, when my daughter calls and she's crying. And when and you're having this conversation, you're saying you're having this conversation by phone? Yes, sir. Okay. Continue. So it got to the point, Your Honor, where apparently... Russell Jr. broke the game, and no, Your Honor. that's where we are right now, where I would call, talk to Teresa over and over again, but as usual, she would make it very difficult. Why would she tell make her, it difficult for you, sir? Why? Yes. It's just what she does, Your Honor. All right. It's just what she does. All right, Ms. Collins, is the game broke right now? Yes. All right. Who's going to get this game fixed? I don't know who broke the game console, Your Honor. Like, he brought it. Like, I teach my children to share. It's just the two? Yes. Okay. So, um, wherever toy that Shauna have, she share with Russell. Russell share his toy with Shauna. But okay. he's not sharing but the toy. It's her toy, and he took it over. The TV in the living room is broken, so I had to put the game console in his room so they could play it. Why didn't you Shauna, put it in her room? Hold on, sir. Sir. No. You're not running this courtroom. <laughs> Ms. Collins, you said that you had a TV in the living room area. Yes. That TV's broken. Yes. The game console needed to be played on the television. Right. Is the only other television in Russell's room? Yes, Your Honor. You don't have a television in your bedroom? No. Why does Russell get the television as opposed to anyone else? Mm -hmm. Because his father... I don't need a testimony or an amen, sir. <laughs> Go ahead. Because his father bought him that TV. That he had a TV for a long time. Russell's dad bought him a television. Long time ago. Okay. And so that's the only other TV where the game console can work. Right. All right. And Russell and Shauna have two different bedrooms. Correct. All right. So what's really going on here? He's just jealous of the fact that I moved on. What do you mean he's jealous? Please. Because I'm about to get married soon to Russell's father. <laughs> Oh, you got back together yes, with Russell. Yes, I got Russell's. back together. How him. long is that? The reason why you all broke up? No. He well, hasn't really been there yes, for me, in Your Honor. Actually, well, wait. Well, which is it? Is it yes or no? Well, it, it's pretty much both. We got into an argument because she was cheating with Russell's father, and eventually she kicked me out. How are you gonna cheat on wait, somebody? No, 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 no. We're not going there. You talk to me. Sorry. So. Um, so you still had feelings for Ms. Collins, and... At the time. That was a long time ago. How long ago are we talking? Uh, six and a half years. Because Probably. you talk as if it was just yesterday. I am... You just balled your fist up just now. Stop. Did you see what you just did? <sighs> so why are you so angry? Your Honor, I pay my child support. 
And is that true? One of the he things, pays child support? He pays child support. Every yes, month? Every month on, on time. time. But on the time, thing about it, month, he don't spend honor. time with his daughter. He's supposed to see her every other Saturday, and he haven't been doing that. Is that true, sir? Your Honor, I work about I six days I a week. I talk about your job. You're here because of your daughter, right? Right. You pay your child support. That's good. Too many men don't. She said you pay it on time. So money's not an issue, right? No. Are you seeing your daughter on a regular basis, sir? Your Honor, I see my daughter as often as I possibly can. You didn't answer my and question. Are you seeing her every other Saturday? Yes or no? No, sir. I work Why nice. not? Your Honor, uh, again, um, if I'm not working, I'm using every waking moment that I can to see my daughter. And the only yeah. time that I am... we're talking about am, two times a month, correct? Every other Saturday, twice a month. Are you seeing your daughter at least twice a month? Not all the time, Your Honor, no. Okay. Then what are you working for? This is America's Court with Judge Ross. We're back with the case of Levi Berry, who is suing his daughter's mother, Teresa Collins, for giving away his child's game system. Basically, this game, it, it's one of the gifts that I got her, Your Honor, where I, I want her to being see a gift. it. I, what I'm not understanding is, if you're not happy with her parenting, why don't you step up and say, let me have the relationship with my daughter, and I'll use this game as a way of connecting with her. Your Honor, I, I, I'm working on that, actually. It's one of the things I am working towards right now. You need to I'm... stop working and do it, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm going to ask you, what's the relationship, in your opinion, that Mr. Barry has with his father? He don't really talk to his father like that because he's so busy that his whole life is around his business. That's all it's about, his work, his business. His family comes last, his business comes first. That's the problem that I have with him the whole the time in the relationship. The reason I'm doing no, my no, business. No, 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 I'm not talking to you. I'm not talking to you, sir. And that was the issue? Yes, that was the issue the whole time. My dad couldn't, he couldn't give me anything. Look at me. He was never. Look at me. Go ahead. Your dad couldn't give you anything but what? I guess it's time, but... And that wasn't good enough for you? It's not that it wasn't good enough. It's... I just don't want my daughter to have to go through the same struggles and pain that I went through. And I told myself that would never happen. That would never happen to Shauna. She'd never understand what it's like you to have to, have to right choose now. between food or a pair of underwear. That's never going to happen to my daughter. I'm not going to let that happen. Do you understand me? I understand, but you're doing you... that to her. Okay. I think I've heard enough. Based on the evidence and the testimony before this court, the gavel is going to come down in favor of the plaintiff in this case. He is entitled to make sure that his daughter gets to play with the item that he bought for her. You said, I don't have any problems fixing it, so I'm going to hold that order for 10 days, give you an opportunity okay. to get it fixed, and on the next visit with Dad, the game council will go with Shauna. Okay. It does not have to be either or, sir, because ultimately what's going to happen is the relationship that Shauna has with you will really dictate the relationship she will have with other men. And if you keep sending the message that I'll just buy you things, then that's the message she's going to get when she's grown. And see, men, as you know what, as long as you buy me stuff, I'm good. Judgment in favor of the plaintiff. That is the order. Good luck to you all.